Well, hi everybody. Here it is Monday. We have occasional storms going on and sometimes some heavy rain, but it is going to be turning cooler. We needed to wash the atmosphere out, cool things off a little bit. It's just been so muggy and humid lately. So a look ahead now for the next several hours through the nighttime tonight. Still the possibility of occasional storms. Temperatures dropping down to about 69 or 70 degrees for the overnight tonight. The sun sets at 825. So here's a look at the Storm Team 10 storm tracker. As you can see, we have some areas of rain. No severe thunderstorm watches or warnings are in effect at this time. However, we have had some areas of heavy rain here at the TV station. It just poured down rain a little while ago. We got 68 hundredths of an inch of rain during that time. So it rained a lot. As I mentioned earlier, up around Mecca, it poured down rain as well. A couple of inches of rain, as a matter of fact, in just a very short period of time. And so now we take a look at the precipitation rate down here. Well, south, here's Lewis, and here is Sullivan County with a little thunderstorm making a rainfall rate of about 1.34 inches per hour. So that is really heavy rain coming down in a very short period of time. And so because of that, we've had reports of flooding uh, in some roads and streets and places like that, the usual spots, and also a few power outages as well. So let's take a look down a little farther to the south. You get here uh, to Knox County and to Davies County, where the rain is just moving in down to Odin and Montgomery, which, by the way, if I look a little heavier, it's because we went on my vacation, went down at eight in Montgomery and then went up to Odin, went to the meat locker. And so all I did over my vacation was eat and just lie around the house. So here we have uh, Ida, which was a hurricane. It's just causing horrible uh, mess down here into uh, Louisiana and now moving up into Memphis. Here's two o'clock on Tuesday morning. Here's four o'clock, five o'clock, six o'clock. But see, here's seven o'clock tomorrow. Here's the center of what was Ida here. And then this is moving up through here. And so we're not going to get a whole lot of rain out of Ida or because of Ida, as you can see here on the Storm Team 10 Futurecast. So let's take a look at what we have going on for the forecast tonight. Occasional storms, maybe some heavy rain at times with an overnight low of 68. And then for tomorrow, some scattered storms. The wind turns to the northeast tomorrow, a high of 81. That northeast wind is good because down to 62, cooler, partly cloudy tomorrow night. And look at this seven day forecast. Hey, this is so nice. Temperatures in the 80s, overnight lows in the upper 50s as we get into this week. Susan? Not bad at all.